Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Kick It In with Kia B. And as you can see, we have another Shein haul. This one is going to be a mini haul. So if you want to see what I got, please stay tuned. Hey everyone, so as you know from the intro, we have another Shein haul. You guys, I am like in love with Shein. They are so inexpensive and their quality is great. Like I'm really surprised at the quality and also I'm surprised at the fact that when you wash these items, they don't shrink. I personally have not experienced any major shrinking in anything that I've purchased from Shein prior to today. Um, as far as clothing items, this is the first time I've ever actually purchased clothing items as far as like clothing. The other items were all pajamas aside from a pair of leggings and um, biker shorts that I bought a long, long time ago. So in this haul, I have a few clothing items as well as a couple more pajama items. So unfortunately, this is not an actual try on haul this time around, but I do want to show you guys what I went ahead and picked up. And we are going to start off with some black leggings. You can't go wrong with black leggings, you guys. Like you need to have at least three, four, five, maybe six, seven pair of black leggings in your wardrobe. And they're just like some shiny black, not shiny, but they're like polyester spandex. They're not cotton. The majority of the leggings that I get are cotton. So um, I just got some black leggings. I will have the prices on the screen of everything and how much everything costs. So black leggings. And then I went ahead and got this really, really cute sweater. You guys, look how cute this is. Really, really cute. By the way, I have tried all of these items on. And again, I messed up and got bigger than what I should have because I'm still in the mindset of go bigger because you don't really know how the sizes work. My sister just got on me today about that. Um, my daughter got on me about it. They was like, you don't wear those sizes anymore. And it's like, but still, like I'm afraid to purchase smaller clothing um, from websites that I don't really shop from. I've shopped from Shein before, but to get pajamas, not actual clothing item. So I'm good in the pajama area, but it's the clothing item that I was a little bit skeptical about. So I did get bigger sizes than what I should have. Um, but this sweater here, I actually got this sweater in a... So I got the majority of the things in a 4X and a few things in a 5X. And I could have actually got this in a 3X. But nonetheless, it fits a little loose and I'm fine with that. But it's really cute, you guys. Now we're going to move on to the next clothing item, which is this really cute dress, you guys. So it has like a little neck it's not really like a full turtleneck but it's kind of like a half turtleneck and then it just has all of these pretty colors and it is long sleeve as you can see and it would probably fall like a little bit below my knees but you guys i thought that this dress was really really cute on um the model so I decided to get it. I don't know where I'm wearing it to, but when we can go outside again, at least I'll have some cute clothes to wear. Shucks. <laughs> so then I also got this cute like little tie-dye like shirt. It's really cute, you guys. It's kind of like, it doesn't fit tight like the shirt that I have on now. It's a loose t-shirt, short sleeve, and it has if I can open it up, it has like some slits here on the side. So I thought that that was really, really cute. And it's like something that's comfortable that you can just wear 
throw on some jeans, throw on some leggings, and keep it pushing. So the next clothing item that I got, sorry it fell, is this cute dress. It's like a t-shirt dress. So this would probably come like right um, past my knees. And it does have the scoop bottom, if you can tell how it's scooped. It's a t-shirt dress, but it also has this tie that you tie around. So I'm gonna assume that you could probably wear it with or without the tie, but it does tie in the front. It's a really cute dress though. I really, really like it. So again, whenever we get out of quarantine, that's what I'll be wearing on a date or, you know, with some tennis shoes. That'll be really cute with some cute tennis shoes. Yeah. Okay, you guys, so here is another pajama. Really cute. It says love with a heart. It's shorts. See the little shorts here? So it's shorts. And it's long sleeve. And when I saw it, I was like, that's something else that's really, really cute to just lounge around the house and you guys with us being inside I don't want to put on regular clothes you know my cute outside type clothes to lounge around in the house but I want to be comfortable and a little bit of, a little bit cute when I'm lounging around in the house so <laughs> I thought that this would be really really cute it does button up the in the front so you know I'm gonna try it out and if I really like these, and I think that I would buy a few more of these, maybe some that are short sleeve once, you know, we start getting into the warmer months, go for a short sleeve one. And last, but not least, I bought another pajama, which is something that I can lounge around in the, around the house as well. And this is it's really cute you guys it has elephants on it so i got this one in a 5x because it's a onesie i didn't really know how it was going to fit so i was a little nervous and it does fit a little big you guys i'm not gonna lie but nonetheless i'm still wearing it it's around the house i could have got it in a 3x but oh scary me scared to purchase stuff i'm still in that mindset of you know when you're overweight or you're a plus size i should say for me it's you get a little scared to purchase clothes especially online there's not a lot of um plus size clothing places that you can shop online you know like you have ashley stewart which i love ashley stewart um, I, when I found Ashley Stewart, I felt like that's when I became a, not really comfortable being plus size, but um, knowing that I could shop comfortably, knowing that I'll be able to find something cute in my size versus going into stores like, you know, Burlington's and Ross. It's kind of a hit or miss with those types of stores. Um, and so now that I found Fashion to Figure, which is, you know, a whole nother plus size store and now Shein and Shein is just for everyone but for them to go up to a 5x is like mind-blowing because you those types of clothes or these types of clothes you don't normally see in those bigger sizes at these cheap prices you guys like it's crazy and it's great quality so Shein has really become like my new best friend in a sense <laughs> but um yeah you guys so this is just a onesie buttoned up in the front and it is long not shorts it's pants and then it's a long sleeve and i just thought that this was so freaking cute where i can just take me a nice hot shower and you know i'm always bundled up when i'm downstairs i have my little basket of blankets you know instead of me bundling up so much I can put on something like this and you know stay a little bit warmer so yeah you guys this is the end of my 
Shein Mini Haul. You guys see, it's very, very mini. <laughs> but stay tuned because I plan on having more hauls coming. Um, I literally just cleaned out my closet today of everything that I know for a fact that I am never, ever, ever going to wear again. And there are some items that I was still holding on to, even though I've lost some weight. And they fit a little bit big. I'm trying to, even though I'm buying stuff still bigger than what I should be buying, but they do fit me a little bit better than my old clothes did. My old clothes are kind of like really baggy. And, you know, it's time to embrace the fact that I have lost some weight and to stop being in the mindset of, even though I've lost some weight, I'm still thinking I need to buy these bigger sizes. So now I'm starting to learn my size in Shein and my sizes. Um, now that I lost weight for Ashley, I bought something from Ashley, some um, leggings. I got a, a 3X and they're too big. So it's just like different clothing places. The sizing, the sizings are different. So I can't just shop the same size at every store. It's going to vary. So I would rather buy a few items just to see if I can fit them or what my size is. And then um, from there, I can go ahead and purchase a few more things. But I do still plan on continuing to lose weight. So, um, yeah, with that being said, this is the end of this here haul. So stay tuned for the next haul. You guys, thank you so much for those of you that have been sticking around with me here at Kick Me With Kia B. I appreciate your love and your support. And, you know, I just hope that we will continue to grow. It's very, very slow, but sure, slowly but surely it will happen. Um, I'm not in a rush. Um, you know, I do this because I like to watch authentic people on YouTube and, um, People who are not just doing it to um, build a career out of it, I guess you can say. Even though having a career as a YouTuber, I'm sure it's very nice. But sometimes you got to sell your soul to Satan and do some things that you normally probably wouldn't do or try to jump on a bandwagon that you wouldn't normally jump on just to be successful. However, I'm not that person. Everything that I put on YouTube is authentic. It's me. You ain't going to catch no crazy stuff going on over here. So I hope that you are enjoying what it is that I like and or what I'm doing. And I hope that you like it. <laughs> and not only that, but if you know people who ain't into all of the crazy things that goes on and you just want, you know, they just want to see something that's authentic, some, you know, makeup that's for people that's not too much into the beauty world. I love wearing makeup, but I don't wear makeup every single day. Um, you know, so if you're, if you know anyone who's interested in the things that I have going on on my channel, just go back and watch all of the videos that I have, um, on there. And if it's something that I reach out to you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so that you do not miss an upload. Follow me on my Instagram. I have Mrs. Bagsby, which is my main page. I also have Kia B.20. That is my um, my weight loss page. And also I have bougie on a budget. So it's bougie underscore on a budget 1980. You guys, that information will also be down in the description box. If you want to follow me on any of my Instagram platforms. And so with that being said, I love you all. Thank you to my new subscribers. Welcome to the family. Welcome. We welcome you with open arms. And for those of you that's been kicking it with Kia B for a minute, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. I love y'all. We're in 2021, you guys. Today is the first. We are in 2021. Y'all gonna see this video after the first, but I'm doing it today in 2021, January the 1st, 2021. So you guys, we are just going to pray for blessings love um that the the lord heals this land and you know just blesses everyone this upcoming year so until i see y'all in the next video uh we're gonna end this one right now with this she and haul so i love y'all and i'll see you in the next one bye